Hey, what's up? We're back with uh, Putt Putt enters the race. Now let's see what's over here. It's the Car Town Wash. Huh? An empty bottle. This doesn't belong here. I should recycle it. All right, cool. Well, we can't go in because we don't have any money. So, all right. Ugh, excuse me. It's Car Town Gas. Regular gas. Okie dokie, fill her up. Cool. This bottle doesn't belong on the ground. It should be recycled. <laughs> it looks like he's gonna go really fast. <laughs> it's the racing form I got from Redline Rick. I still need to find some extra high-powered, high-octane gasoline, some super speedy radial racing tires, a safety helmet for Pep, and a triangular flag with the number six on it. And then I'll be ready to enter the race. That extra high-powered, high-octane gasoline doesn't last very long. I should take some of it with me to the race so I can use it there. Yeah, but we'll need something to carry it with. Extra high-powered, high-octane gasoline. Fill her up. Whoa, I'm humming like a race car. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, the humanity. <laughs> I bet when I use that extra high-powered, high-octane gas for the race, I'll zoom as fast as a real race car. Hey, it's Chuck, and it looks like he's in trouble. Putt Putt, how's my little buddy? I'm fine, Chuck, but what happened to you? Oh, one of my rubber radials hit a nail, popped it like a balloon. <laughs> I'm one stuck Chuck. Maybe I can help. If you would, I'd be a happy tow truck. How's about heading over to my tire setter and picking me up a tire patch kit? And judging by my tire, you'll need to cut it into a triangle. Oh, I can do that, Chuck. Thanks, little buddy. I'd be much obliged. Oh, Chuck. We'll help you, Chuck. Don't worry. Meep. It's a parade. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> oh, ooh, okay. Ooh, this is another part of Car Town. That's neat. Uh, how about we go here first? Oh my gosh, Outback Al. Hi, Outback Al. Well, if it isn't Putt Putt, long time no see, matey. How do you like my newest addition? It's a baby lemur. Oh, it's really cute. Stayed home today to take care of the little bugger. Only problem is, he's hungrier than a mm. crocodile in a grub nest, and I can't for the life of me remember what he eats. Wouldn't help either, because I can't leave him alone to go buy anything anyway. Maybe I could find out what he eats and then pick it up for you, Outback Al. Jackaroo, you're on. <laughs> He, he sounds like he should be uh, Steve Irwin's replacement. Yeah, he's even got the accent to boot. Is that a racing flag? 
It sure is, Putt-Putt. Why? Did you need it for something? I sure do. For the Car Town 500. Go ahead and take it. I don't need it. Gee, thanks. But first, I'll bring you some food for your baby mm. lemur. He looks hungry. Are you serious? You're not going to take that right now? All right. <laughs> That's fine. farm the vegetables are popping up and the fruits are filling in the latest report is that the crops are above average and real good looking this year drive on out and take a look cool uh-oh this does look oh dear hi mr fender bender well if it is a pit pit this has been a heck of a day Bonzo, my cat, charged up my tree. I mean, charged up my tree, and he can't get down. At least he's got his safety helmet on. It's too high to reach, but maybe I can find something I can use to get him down for you, Mr. Fender Bender. That's a Cracker Jack idea, son. <laughs> okay, this guy's genius. I like... That Bonzo sure is a goofy cat. <laughs> Ooh. Mm. Bean. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. 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 Ooh. This is uh interesting. Put put. Hello. Hi, Mrs. Airbag. How are you doing today? I'm afraid not very well. Ralphie buried Mr. Airbag's new hubcaps in the backyard. Mr. Airbag's not going to be too pleased about that, I can assure you. Maybe I can help you dig them up, Mrs. Airbag. Oh, Putt-Putt, that would be wonderful. Great! Now all I have to do is find a shovel, and I'll be back. Thank you so much, Putt-Putt. <laughs> okay. Whatever you say, Mrs. Airbag. <laughs> cool. And we got the animals communicating here. Oh. Cool. Okay. Hello. I shouldn't bother him. He's reading. Ooh. Look at all these arts and crafts stuff. Those are the library safety scissors. I can use them to cut out shapes. But I don't have anything I want to cut now. Hey, odd animals of the alphabet. I'd like to take a look at that. A is for Arvark. Ooh, we can learn about lemurs here. Arvark needs to squirm. Termites instantly like to crunch the such <laughs> Okay. Okay. This thing is rhyming. That's funny. Bush baby? Okay. <laughs> Wow. Capybara. <laughs> okay. No. Dugong. Emu. Fat Dormouse. Okay. <laughs> Greater Bilby. What? Very rare, huh? Hyrex. <laughs> okay. Ibex. Jerboa. Oh, gosh. Okay. Kinkajou. Oh, I've heard of this one. Uh, 
Okay. They climb up trees. They grow. They grow no speed on plants and leaves, but milk is what the babies need. Ooh, this could be good. L is for lemur. Lemurs are primates with black ring tails. They climb up trees, then leap and sail. The grown-ups feed on plants and leaves, but milk is what the babies need. Oh, the babies drink milk. I should go find some so Outback Al can feed his baby lemur. Cool. Now let's see what the others are, just for fun. Mud skipper. <laughs> okay. Numbat. Oh. Uh, oh. Okay. <laughs> Termites. Oh, copy. Oh, well, I've heard of this one too. Polecat. Oh. Oh my. Ugh, excuse me. Oh. Wow. Quokka, huh? <clears throat> a wallaby, huh? Last time I saw a wallaby, it had a modern life. Enough said. R is for re what? Rattle? Rattle? Okay. Wow. Sugar glider. Oh, wow. Uh, Tarsier? Let's see. T is for Tarsier. Here's a little mammal called a Tarsier. He hunts at night and sleeps all day. His eyes are big as big can be. He has sticky feet to climb up trees. Tarsier. Oh, I guess they use the French uh, um, pronunciation. Uakari? What? It's Kacha. Hmm. Wombat. Ziphosura, huh? Why is for yak? A zorilla. <laughs> All right. Cool. What's in this other book? Uh, okay. <laughs> okay, let's explore the another part of the town. Oh my! Oh no, that shed is on fire! What should I do? I'll bet I can use that phone to get help. Please do not hang up until I tell you to. First, what is the problem? There's a fire. And what is your name? Putt Putt. And what's the address of the fire, Putt Putt? It's the old shed out on Valley Road. Okay, Putt Putt. Smokey's on his way. You may hang up the phone now. Okay. He's here. Wow, that was fast. Thanks for calling 911, Putt Putt. Now stay over here where you're safe, and I'll put this fire out. <laughs> Mission accomplished. And now, Putt-Putt, I believe you've earned a special reward. Your Junior Fire Marshal badge, because you alerted me to an emergency. Wow, thanks, Smokey. Believe me, you earned it, Putt-Putt. Enjoy. I hope to see you around. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to head back to the station. Bye, Smokey! <laughs>
cool. That's neat. That's very neat. <laughs> Smokey did a great job putting out that fire. <laughs> That's probably the coolest thing I've ever seen. Honestly. Wow. Uh, where do I go? It's a picture of a horn. Hmm. Hmm. Hot ziggity, a bottle. Hmm. What was that I ran over? Well, who knows, because I can't see a thing. Ooh. Hi, Torval Tractor. Oh, hey there, Potfoot. What brings you out this way? Mr. Baldini wanted me to pick up some things at your farm. Oh, yeah. He told me all about that. You go right ahead. Thanks. Wow, it's a flashlight. Hey, Potfoot, you want that old thing? It's not really working. Do you know what's wrong with it, Torval? Oh, yeah. No batteries. Go ahead and take it. Gee, thanks. Oh, don't you go mentioning it now. Cool. You know, I wonder... Hey, I bet the batteries I got at the toy store will fit in this. Perfect. Great. Now we got a working flashlight. Cool. I have a row of cabbage which I grow upon my farm. This tasty vegetable certainly has a charm. I can shred it for a salad or boil it for a stew. The cabbage that I grow is a gift from me to you. <laughs> cool. Okay, we need some uh, cauliflower, a carrot, and what was the last one? I still need to find an, an apple. apple, a carrot, and a head of cauliflower. Alright. Oh, it's a point and click game. Yeah, I forgot. <laughs> no, you never forget. I'm not sure how to get there from here. Oh my god, this garden is a maze. Seriously. Hmm. My knowledge of where plants grow is kind of rusty, but I think... I don't see anything I can pick right there. Hmm. Grapes. I don't need grapes, unfortunately. This is probably one of the craziest things about playing for the first time. You have no idea where you're going. And I am willing to bet they change it every time you play, so yeah. I doubt I could get it around anyway.
That looks like eggplant. I think. I'm not sure. The drawing on this thing is pretty... Whoa. Well, actually, it's pretty cool, actually. <sighs> Too many pumpkins. Oh, I see cauliflower. I need to go around, but how? That's what I thought. Man, it's kind of difficult to navigate this maze. Even with the simple controls. Look! Broccoli! Mr. Baldini didn't need any of that. Yeah, I didn't think so. I mean, I knew that already. <laughs> oh, I can pick wow, carrots. Wow, carrot! I need one of those. I think I'll pick it. Cool. Check it out, cauliflower. Mr. Baldini wanted one of those. I better pick one. That's it. I filled the box. Now I have to take it back to Mr. Baldini. Great, now I have to get out of the vegetable patch. That's wonderful. to go that way. Cool. I made it out. Finally. Hi, Turbo Tractor. I'm back. You sure are. I found all the things Mr. Baldini wanted. Good for you, Potput. Let's get out of here. Oh, it's a hook. It's a hook. That's a dangerous thing to have in the road. I better pick it up. Nothing else here.
Ooh, there's another path over here. Let's take it and see where it leads. Uh, first I probably should have returned these... These groceries to... Aw, oh, poor Chuck. Uh, Mr. Baldini. Okay. Here you go, Mr. Baldini! Thank you, Putt Putt. And just like I promised, here's a two of coins. Thanks. You're welcome. And if you want to fill up another produce box, you just let me know. Cool. Smokey, is it okay with you if I borrow your ladder now? Of course, Pot Pot. After all, you've earned your junior fire marshal badge. Thanks, Smokey. I'll be sure to return it. Cool. All right, now let's go rescue that cat. Yeah. Son, go for it. Here, Bonzo. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. My dings and dents, you did it. Now let's take this helmet off you once and for all, Bonzo. Bonzo won't climb trees if he doesn't have a helmet on. I think I'll just get rid of it. If you don't want it, Mr. Fender Bender, I wouldn't mind having it. I need a helmet for Pep, so we can enter the Car Town 500. By all means. I mean, by all means. You take it, son. I'd be bonkers to let Bonzo wear that thing again. Thanks, Mr. Fender Bender. I'm going to the store to get some kitty bets. I'll drop off the ladder at the fire station for you, Pet Pet. Don't worry, Pet Pet. I'll take the ladder back to Smokey for you. It's the least I can do. I mean, the least I can do. Explore the rest of the car town after this.